even if you're very delicate with your hot wheels, one of the first things to wear is the plating on the wheels. This is a Porsche I wheel swapped. Cracked this one open, drilled it apart, put a different set of wheels on it, and as you can tell, they're looking very worn already, and it's only really been played with very minimally by my kids, and it's been sitting in the center console of my vehicle, my Jeep. So, pick yourself up a couple of Sharpies. For about five bucks, you can buy a two pack of these. These are felt tip. Extra fine point, I should say. I'm sorry, extra fine ones, not felt tip. Um, and so you can use these. You have to shake them up first and get the ink to flow. And afterwards, let's see if I can prep this up just right, so you guys can see. Afterwards, you can very delicately come in and you can actually spin the wheel around, touch it to the edge, and spin the wheel as you do it. I have to wipe off excess. I'm going to do this on a few of these wheels and show you. So, I'm spinning the wheel and at the exact same time, as I'm spinning it, I'm touching this fine tip to the outer edge that's worn. If you mess up and you go over the edge, no big deal do that too but if you're delicate and careful you can avoid doing this I, I was awkwardly trying to make a video while spinning the wheels so essentially the like I said one of the most one of the quickest things to wear on a mainline hot wheels are those chromed wheel tips and also sometimes you get a car with awkward wheels, they're, maybe they're all black, they're black BBS's like on that Porsche 944 recently. And you just want to spruce it up a little bit. Or actually, no, I'm sorry, the Carrera. The Porsche Carrera is the one that had the black BBS's. So if you take this and gently go in there, very carefully, very slowly, you can make the BBS wheels gold or silver, or even by different colors. They're reasonable, they last you a long time. One thing I learned recently, when you store these, do not store them tip up or tip down. I always thought tip up was a, was appropriate and a, the right way to do it so that they would last a long time. You actually want to store them flat. I've heard this now from multiple people who seem to know what they're talking about. Store these flat so that the ink is not pooling at the bottom or the top. And then shake them up and use them regularly. That, that always helps too.